Hello my loves, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Tatiana and today I have a very special video to share. It is based on a dream that I had last night and this dream was rather educational. It was not one of those dreams that where I would want to keep a secret so that way it manifests even faster. This dream was packed and loaded with downloads with information that I felt that were allowing me to align more energetically at a subconscious level and I felt that it would go very much hand in hand with my YouTube channel and with what I share inside of this container that is very precious and special and sacred to me. That is why whenever I start recording a video, I set the intention that those who are ready to receive this video or the video that I'm recording are the ones who are going to be aligned to the video, are the ones who are going to be able to receive that information. As I have learned a lot of lessons the hard way and I am aware of that. Most change does not happen overnight. However, I do believe in planting seeds of change those seeds that as long as we continue to nurture them as long as we continue to believe in them they will flourish before we realize it so going back to the dream i would want to call it lucid because i was very much aware of what was going on around me and i was presented two timelines and I was able to see how I was able to jump timelines. So in the first part of the dream, I saw a reality where I was able to notice everything was normal, everything was ordinary, nothing exactly special. And then I was shown how I was able to jump into another timeline. And in this timeline, it felt that it was about six months to a year difference and I was shown how the problems, the insecurities, the concerns that I had on the first timeline no longer even applied to the second timeline. They were not even a concern anymore. I was essentially presented a reality where things were already solved, where solutions had already happened and what was very beautiful was that the people that were presented in the first timeline were still represented in the second timeline however even they had already changed their association even they had already given me the confirmation of oh you already overcame that yeah that's already solved oh you already don't have that issue anymore and what was also so interesting is that even the seasons felt different. It would be as if you're starting in the fall and then you're presented a timeline where it is the spring time already. And you just know that there has been a change. And what I took from this dream is that this is an example of how we continue to be a prisoner of our own mindset. We continue to be a prisoner of our own limitations and we forget that in nature we are shown through the seasons how things continue to change. Nothing remains the same. Everything is able to regrow and reform. And when we apply that type of concept to our dreams, our desires, what we are wishing to manifest, we forget that the limitations that we have right now are not going to be the same ones that we're going to have once we have already moved ahead and once we have already manifested our dreams, our desires, our goals. We're going to have different problems because that's life. When we look at celebrities who have reached the top, they might not have financial struggles, but they do have other issues. They could be more like family issues or psychological issues or there's some kind of issue going on that is part of the duality of life we're going to have to be able to balance life one way or another that's also what keeps us motivated that's also what keeps us growing and learning and what keeps us continue to grow our wisdom and be able to spread it and have an impact on this planet 
and everyone has their own gifts. Everyone has their own talents. God has gifted us with very specific and individual skill sets that only us get effortlessly, only us have been drawn towards since we were little, since we remember. And similarly, everyone's going to have a different calling. Everyone's going to have a different talent. But we should not be blinded or limited by the illusion that just because life is not going exactly as we want it to go or as we would expect it to go, that it doesn't mean that there is no other side of the coin when there is. When we look at the moon, when we look at the different faces that we are able to witness, it's the same moon that Jesus looked at, it's the same moon that Einstein looked at, it's the same moon that your grandparents looked at. Time really is an illusion when we look at how the moon has been there for how long? How many billions of years? And yet, it's a beautiful reminder of there is light and there is darkness. For everything, there is an opposite. For everything, there is another side. And the moon is so timeless that it connects us to the depths of not only our soul and our heart, but it aligns us also to those who already have aligned to it and have gained inspiration from it. And whenever we look at nature, that's what we gain. That's why it's so peaceful. That's why we feel balanced and grounded because it's so timeless. And something that I am passionate talking about is your authentic timeless alignment. Essentially is that string of timeline. And this string line shows you where your passions lie, where you have your power to manifest, because it's connected to your soul, because it's connected to the vortex of the universe, it's connected to God, to the universe. And what is so beautiful about being aware of your authentic timeless alignment is that your passions are all in here, your desires are all in alignment. It's part of the same string that is this lifetime for you. So the five-year-old version of yourself, the 15-year-old version of yourself, the 25-year-old version of yourself, the 50-year-old version of yourself, the 80-year-old version of yourself, they're all connected to this string line, this timeline. And when you're connected to your soul, when you're connected to your passions, that is when you're able to connect to your highest version of yourself. That is when you're able to continue to raise your vibration and raise your consciousness because this is energetic. This is not something that you need to gain. This is something that you need to remember. You need to go back to, just like connecting to your heart. When you're connecting to your heart, it's not possible to be angry when you're at peace, just like it would not be possible to be joyful, to be so much in love with life, and at the same time be miserable and be hating everything that comes across your way. Though That does not exist. You cannot be happy and be miserable at the same time. You cannot be cold and be hot at the same time. So that is part of the duality of life. Being able to be aware that for everything, there is a time and place and similarly for your dreams, for your goals, for your desires, there is a place to cultivate them. And the more that you cultivate them, the more that you're gonna connect to that string of time that aligns and manifests a lot more effortlessly because it's coming from the most powerful place in the world, which is your heart. That is what is connected to the universe, even Einstein wrote to his daughter that the most powerful energy in the world is love and your heart is love your heart is purity your heart is zen your heart does not wish evil it does not wish to harm anyone when we're connected to our heart we're connected to our passions we are connected to the best version of ourselves and when we're connected to the best version of ourselves things just align effortlessly and that's when we ma we manifest without even trying that's when manifestations just come in effortlessly and that is a pattern that i noticed that the more that i connected to my heart the more that i connected to 
actually being in my feminine energy. When you realize that you have been created to do something special and unique and only you can do it and you only you have been gifted with those talents and you continue to cultivate them you're gonna be living from your heart you're gonna be living from your purpose and then things are going to align it's not easy at first because it's a change any type of change that we go through requires us to be able to get into new habits to be able to rewire our conscious mind in our subconscious which takes longer however if we do not align with our heart's purpose if we do not align with what we were meant to enjoy in this lifetime years are gonna go by decades are gonna go by especially for women this is something that hurts us more in the long run as we're realizing that actually nature and biology calls and we actually do want something meaningful we actually do want to pour our love and our presence to a home be able to be able to open our heart to someone truly special and unique and be able to multiply ourselves in a beautiful way where we're able to make an impact and that is why this channel is the femme universe femme meaning in french woman and also wife and that is why i love connecting to women who are in touch with their feminine essence and be able to multiply the beautiful essence because when we're connected to the beautiful essence we are able to be connected to god's gifts that were given to us and we're able to nurture others we're able to make an impact in the world just by being ourselves and also we're able to connect to good men through our heart place and be able to have loving and beautiful relationships and those exist if you exist your counterpart exists the values that you have exist out there for that special someone that you are destined to enjoy life with and similarly you are destined for more that you have been able to even like scratch the surface off so going back to this dream i really felt that this is a beautiful example of how when we're connected to our purpose even in our dreams we're going to get downloads we're going to get information at a subconscious level that the logic of the mind is not able to understand but you are able to understand it at a profound way that puts two and two together essentially for you and the more that you continue to listen to yourself the more that you continue to align to your heart the more that you continue to raise your vibration continue to raise your values so i want to leave you with the beautiful thought of planting seeds of possibilities planting seeds of love planting seeds of desires that make you feel alive and that make you feel connected to yourself that will eventually after being nurtured and after they grow under the surface that we are not able to see they're going to come back to you multiply times fold so i hope that you enjoyed this video and i hope that you have a wonderful rest of your day thank you so much for being here with me if you know someone who can benefit from this video please feel free to share and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more and I will see you in my next video.